Protesters in Hong Kong are not backing down. <laughs> Pouring rain appropriate for protesters <laughs> as darkness fell, clashes intensified. This is a very tense situation here right now. We recently believe that certain protesters... Demonstrators ransacked the building before raising a British colonial flag 22 years after it was taken down. On August 30th to September 2nd, I went to Hong Kong as a tourist. The Hong Kong protests entered its 13th week. As of the posting of this vlog, the protests are ongoing. What you're about to see is my own personal encounter of the protests as a bystander. Nothing more, nothing less. I neither fight nor do I care or support their cause. They just left uh, Central Station. Uh, a lot of uh, people in protective uh, vests. Probably reporters going to report on the protest or something. We're gonna see what's happening upstairs in a central station. Looks like this place is gonna gear up for a rally very soon. There's a couple of people standing around. The streets, there's no cars on the streets right now. Lots of people in black shirts wearing masks. Definitely some activity going on over here. We're gonna see what it's all about. Uh, definitely a march going on, as you can see behind me. These protesters, they're actually following the traffic lights. Also, yep. Yesterday when I was here, there was traffic at this road. Now the traffic is totally blocked off, I think, due to the protests. But uh, this is such a sight to see, you know. You never get this in Singapore. Standing on the other side of the street now, which I feel is much more safer for me. But it's a really chaotic scene here. People are chanting slogans, the police are over there. 
with uh, right -aid gear. If it were to get violent, I'll probably move out of here. Okay, it started raining, um, but definitely did not dampen the spirits of these protesters right now. I'm gonna go and find shelter before my camera gets wet. Taking <laughs> shelter in the government offices. Uh, rain is getting heavier, but definitely it's not dampening the spirits of this. Uh, Protesters. Yeah, there's a chaotic scene here because almost everybody is taking shelter over here. I've been under shelter in government offices for quite a while now. Uh, looks like this part of the protest has already moved on. The roads are already clear with protesters in front of me. Uh, I don't know where to go next but I think maybe I should walk up the hill or something. Looks like another wave for protesters are coming. For your info guys, I'm not fighting for their cause. I'm not a part of this. I don't really bother about what's happening in Hong Kong. But I'm just here to document uh, the protest itself. Just because these things never really happen, you know. So it's a good topic to talk about. Uh. Okay, I'm still on Hong Kong Island, um, the downtown area, and they've closed off the streets in front of me, and the protest has came to an end over here. The protesters has taken over this shopping area at central Hong Kong. In Pedalus Street, they've taken over this place. On the next episode... Still in central Hong Kong now. Uh, the protest is still... Uh, it's still peaceful. No riot police has been called in. There's no police presence over here. 